Jesse Sunkwa Mills is breaking new ground in Ghana's animated film industry. Together with his team of animators and illustrators, he is retelling indigenous Ghanaian stories through animation. For some time now, over the years, um, our culture, you know, is gradually diminishing. You know, um, we're rather embracing Western culture and all of that, and we're not realizing it, but it's happening really fast. And we felt as a studio that um, we needed to do something about it to help, you know, change the narrative. Mills says it took more than a year to produce the animation film, Asantoa, which is the first of a series to honor Ghana's national heroes. The film tells the story of the Ashanti warrior queen, Ya Asantoa, who led the fight against the British during their colonial rule in Ghana. Crowds flocked to see it when it premiered at cinemas in Accra. This only goes to show how much Ghanaians have been yearning for so long to see something of the sort, you know. Ghanaians have shown that they are really proud of their own. They just weren't getting content like this. That's a message that connected with many in the audience at the film's premiere. The African needs to tell his own stories. So we've heard of Yaa Sintuwa, but to have her brought to light through animation and to do it so sincerely, it was honest, it was humorous, it was effective. I thought it was powerful. And if you're a little girl here, it inspires you to be a woman leader. Ghana produces about 600 films a year, the second highest in Africa after Nigeria, according to UNESCO. But animation is still a long way from becoming mainstream. The premiere of the locally produced animation film is seen by many patrons as not only a time for them to celebrate Ghanaian stories, but also a significant milestone in the country's film industry. They believe it could spare more creativity in local storytelling. Industry insiders, though, say animated film productions require a huge budget. At this point, we'll need some government support. Uh, we need some private sector support too. Uh, government in the sense that there are quite a number of these things that uh, resource that ga government can put in uh, to support associations like ours. So that individuals like uh, the Mills Media, Parable Studios, Animation Africa, and there are many others who uh, have been around for a while uh, can translate some of these local stories into feature films and into television series. So as Jesse Sunkwa Mills moves on to his next project, he hopes other makers of animated films in Ghana can turn their dreams into reality.